Hello, welcome to this section of Mastering Statistics. What we're going to do in this section is really one of the most important things, and that is that we're going to cover a lot of very important basic definitions. I really can't stress this enough. In statistics, more than a lot of other classes, if you don't understand the uh, definitions, then you're not going to understand the math and the problems to come because in a lot of problems they'll say, hey, the population mean of this set of data is something, calculate the sample variance, and if you don't understand what that stuff is, if you don't, if you never learned it, if you kind of glossed over those pages in your book, then it's going to look like Greek, okay? So spend a few minutes with me here and really listen and, and internalize these definitions. There's only about four or five of them. They're not hard, but I can 100% guarantee you that learning them is going to make everything to come easier. And you know, these definitions are not hard anyway. So there will be a lot of writing and writing and writing in this section, but it's very much worth it. So just have to trust me on that a little bit. So the first thing we're going to do is define some basic stuff. We talked about this. What is statistics? Right? We kind of discussed this in the last section, but I want to be clear with sort of a textbook definition so that we can make sure we're all on the same page. Statistics can mean one of two things. The first thing means it's gathering, describing, and analyzing. data. All right, we've talked about this in the last section. We, we did the examples of telephone surveys and other things. Statistics is a word that just usually means you're trying to collect information, usually called, called data, and we're usually trying to analyze it, which means try to figure out what it means and draw conclusions from it. All right. Now, there is a secondary definition that I think you'll agree with once we get it on the board. So that's definition one. And definition two for statistics is the actual numeric um, descriptions of sample data. You know, we haven't talked much about data, but what this basically means is you can use this in two different types of sentences. And the first one is the one everyone thinks about. Statistics is the process of collecting data and analyzing it, basically. That's statistics. But statistics can kind of mean a noun, and that can be uh, the actual numbers that you're collecting in terms of numeric descriptions of whatever data you have. So, for instance, if you collected the heights in the room and you take their average, right, that could be some statistics. The, the, uh, Maybe you, you figure out what's the lowest in your data set and what's the highest in your data set. Just knowing those two pieces of information, those are statistics with regard to your data. The mean, how spread the data is, we're going to talk about the standard deviation later on. Those are statistics. So you can kind of collect your data. The raw data that we have is the actual data that you collect. But when you, you know, calculate numeric descriptions, that's what this means, numeric descriptions, calculations we do with it, a lot of times those calculations, we call them in a broad fashion statistics right um, so we say statistical analysis and things like that that just means you're making those calculations and you're doing the analysis there so this is sort of very basic definitions of what's going on but you can see the point all right so just to make sure everybody's on the same page the data what is data that's just information 